Hi everyone. Welcome to Sandra Sensations. I'm going to be trying to do a wave. I saw a lady called, her name is Molly. Her, her site is Molly's Artistry. She's done some amazing waves and I really wanted to give this a try. And if you haven't already, hit subscribe for me. It's really important and I would love you for it. Thank you very much in advance. And for everybody that's already subscribed, thank you so much. All right, let's get started with the wave. I've got the white acrylic already on here. I'm just gonna give it a quick little torch just to get a few of the bubbles out. There we go. Alrighty. So I'm going to be doing a little bit of metallic. I'm going to pick the sapphire I have in metallic. I'm going to have a little bit of pearl, a little bit of silver. All the blue colors that I have, pretty much, I've picked. So I've done a couple of them where I've mixed them a little bit more fluid than I would usually work. Because I think it will help blow the wave in the direction that I want. So we're going to give that a try. We'll see what happens. All right, so this one is the metallic sapphire I'm going to do first. I'm just going to pour it in the direction I want this wave to go. And I'm going to do a little bit more on the outskirts. Now when I blow this, it's going to blow off the frame and everything, which is exactly what we want it to do. Okay, this might be too much blue, but I'm going to go for it. Not blue, but dark blue, I should say. Okay. Then I've got my ultramarine blue, which is a little bit of a purple color in it. But that's okay because it's abstract art and we can do whatever we want. Okay, then I'm going to add a little bit of silver. should be good and my Bahama blue which is really cool close to an aqua blue so it's more of a green but that's that's what we want because it's going to blend with all these dark blues I'll be happy even if this comes half as close as to what Molly did because hers was just wow. Okay, and I have a little bit of sky blue I'm going to add as well. And my pearl, metallic pearl. I really like the metallic in, in the waves and things like that because it just kind of shimmers when it's hanging on the wall. All right. I haven't put any navy in yet. I think I'll put a little bit of navy. The thickness of the wave will definitely be darker in this area here. And I haven't put in my favorite, which is the deep turquoise. So I have to add that into my painting because I love this color. There we go. 
Okay, and just to make sure it lightens in areas we want, I'm going to add a little bit more white throughout. Okay, hopefully that's enough. Then we're going to make some noise with the blow dryer. Move some of my paint so I don't spray them with blue paint everywhere. Okay. Wish me luck, everybody. Wow, that looks pretty awesome. Okay, so now I'm going to take my straw and blow some of this out. I'm going to do that all the way along just to have it more motion. I'm going to give this a torch because there's definitely some cells happening. Which is just awesome. Okay, I'm going to let that sit for a couple minutes. Blow a little bit more of this. Yeah, it's giving me the wave effect that I want. So I'm going to finish doing all of this. I'm not going to videotape the whole thing. It'll make it too long. I will take a picture of this as soon as I'm done. And that's what I'll use to post my video with. Thanks for watching everybody. I think this turned out amazing. Thank you so much, Molly, for sharing your art. It's just awesome. Have a good one, everyone.